good, YouTube? Today's video is going to be a really fun one. Today I'm going to be giving you guys a tour of my WeWork apartment. Um, I know a lot of you guys might be wondering, how the fuck do I live inside of a WeWork? And that's because WeWork actually has apartment complexes called WeLive. Um, they have two different locations. So they have a location in New York and in D.C. Um, I live here in the D.C. location. I'm absolutely in love with this apartment complex. I've been here now for about a month. And this is my second time living here. I lived here over the summer as well. So the really cool thing about this place that makes it different than most is that it is kind of like an adult dorm style living so basically on every single floor there's a different amenity and there's also three different community kitchens in the apartment so um, for me in my studio I actually don't have a stove and I don't have a dishwasher um, I do have a fridge and a sink which is nice and a microwave um, but if I want to go cook then I actually have to go down to the community kitchen which I actually don't mind too much so yeah I'm gonna take you guys around the entire apartment complex so you guys can get an idea of what it's like living here because like I said it's definitely different than most apartments so there is a WeWork actually in this building. So the WeWork is on the top three floors of the building. It's definitely such a WeWork vibe. There's tons of workspace. There's tons of study space. So if you guys have seen my vlogs and you guys know that I work from home a lot and there's tons of room for me to get work done whenever I'm working from home. So I spend just about as much time in my room as I do outside of my room and you guys will see why. So I'm going to take you guys around my room first and then I'm going to take you guys around the entire building so you guys can get a feel of what it's like to live here. This is the entry way to the apartment so like I said this is a studio so it's um, pretty slim this is like a really cool mirror that they have in the entryway it's huge and this right here is actually my bathroom so I'm gonna show you guys what the bathroom looks like really good size I like love the space in here and you guys can see the shower is a really good size as well so I love this bathroom because there's a huge mirror on the other side of where the mirror was in the entryway. So these are all like medicine cabinets right here. I actually broke this mirror here because I was opening it too fast. But yeah, this is all medicine cabinet space. So I'm not going to show you guys too much in there because it's really messy. But yeah, that's my bathroom. And then, like I said, this is my entryway. So you can see this is my door. And then this is my shoe rack and my coat closet. So yeah, I keep my coats in the coat closet here. Um, the really cool thing about this apartment as well is that there's tons of storage space. And so I have like drawers and drawers of clothes. Um, and there's storage actually underneath my bed, which is really nice. So yeah, my closet is here and then my bed is right across. I am obsessed with this little nook bed thing that I have. It's so cozy and nice. And I wish I could give you guys a better view of what it looks like, but it's literally like a little nook inside the apartment. There's like these curtains that I could close if I wanted to, but I like to have light come in so I keep them open. Um, and you can see there's some storage space up there. So that's where I keep my luggage. And then we're gonna step into the living room and you guys can see um, what the living room looks like. I, there's more shelves right here so you guys can see I keep some books. Um, I keep my like just a little decoration. A lot of this stuff came with the apartment so this came with the apartment. The apartment came with all these books inside of it. This apartment came furnished. It literally is like move in ready. Like they have everything that you can need. Um, it even had some of these like little um, toiletries as you guys will see. But yeah, this is my living room. And then there's more space for like, um, like shelf space. I keep my like camera equipment down here. So the cool thing about this living room is that this actually turns into a pull out bed. So if someone ever comes over and wants to sleep here, I can pull this bed out of the wall and that's another sleeping space. So yeah, and then I really, really like the lighting up here too in the living room. And the cool thing is that I can actually like dim this if I want so I can lower it and I can turn it back on. So yeah, that's my living room, and then this is my kitchen right here. Um, like I said, guys, it's such a like small kitchen space. There's no stove, it's just a microwave, a sink, and then this is actually my fridge right here, um, which is kind of cool because it looks like a cabinet. And there's actually a freezer down here. 
So, and the cool thing is these dishes actually came with the apartment too, so I didn't have to buy any dishes, which was really, really nice. Um, they even have the soap in the dish, like dishwasher soap ready for me. Probably my favorite thing about this kitchen is this magnetic utensil rack that they have. So like you literally can just throw the utensils up like that and they just stay there. So yeah, that's my room and now I'm gonna show you guys the rest of the apartment, the actual building, because there's a lot more to it than just the room. like a huge little workspace basically and this is where I do um, most of my work from home so I'll work like either on this table or I'll go down to a different floor so yeah I love this. this is like one of my favorite floors in the apartment because it's just a nice little study space and then we can go downstairs and then you come up on a media room so this room is like a little TV room there's tons of like I think every couple of floors have has a room like this and then I do a lot of work also here at this table and then there's some more books so then I'm gonna take you guys downstairs to the kitchen um, like I said I don't have a stove in my room so I come down here a lot to use the stove to use the um, toaster and I get coffee down here too so this is the kitchen they have one on every couple of floors they all look the same, so I'm just showing you guys this one. There's a coffee machine right there. And then I get like hot water here for my tea, so they have always have tons of tea, which is really nice. And yeah, this is one of my favorite parts about the kitchen is every day they have fruit water and they have like different fruit almost every single day, so I always come down here and get water. And yeah, that's the kitchen. And then on every floor, they also have like these little cute study areas. I'm gonna take you guys up to the gym so you guys can see what the gym looks like. Okay, so this is the gym. And the cool thing is there's a TV here, so if you ever want to set up like for your classes, you can do classes here. But yeah, and then right below this, there's another one of those media rooms like with a TV. So I'm not really going to show you guys that because it looks just like the other one that I showed you guys. There's another little nook over here. So they call this the honesty market because obviously there's no one here working, but you can just take a snack if you want. And... I think you have to scan it out and I think it charges it like to your room or something. I don't know. So that's it for the apartment tour, you guys. If you guys have any questions about the actual apartment, let me know in the comments down below. And like I say, if you guys haven't already, make sure you guys subscribe to my channel. I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I will see you guys in the next one.